Hey guys, it's Ellie Lath. Welcome back to another gold making video. I wanted to get this video out relatively quickly because it's a limited time event for the Dark Moon Fair. We only have a week, I believe, to make some gold from Dark Moon Fair. Yep, Dark Moon Fair started yesterday and runs till midnight Pacific time, Saturday. So I wanted to make sure that I show you how do I make my gold in between the fairs. And I'm basically here in Org. You can probably find your Dark Moon Mystic Mage in Stormwind. All right, so if you're new to the Dark Moon Fair, and if you're someone who is not new, <laughs> bear with me. I just wanna go through for everyone who might be new to making gold, and I wanna make sure everybody understands what we're doing here. So we are going to go through this portal right here to get to the Dark Moon Fair. Dark Moon Fair has a long trail to get through, so you wanna follow these lovely arrows all the way down this trail here. And what we're going to do is we're gonna fish. I know you guys love these fishing videos. Ha ha, sarcasm. Some of you love to fish, some of you don't, and that's fine. But I wanna show you how you can make some nice food to sell in between the fair. So when the fair is gone, I make a lot of gold selling a certain feast that I can make from the fish here. And in addition, the fish themselves sell for a lot of gold. And also you get some nice dark moon fire water. So the dark moon fire water is used for myself when I'm either, basically when I'm skinning. So when I'm going and doing all my skinning farms, I'm using the dark moon fire water. If you are not someone who's gonna use dark moon fire water to gather, um, it does have a really nice sell rate of 0 0.04 and 86 gold. So you can also fish those up. So here we go really quickly. So this is where you would fish. You can fish anywhere you want. There's really no said spot. Okay, let's start with the basics. Let's start with, let's say you're a brand new character, you're brand new to WoW. You don't even have a fishing, you haven't even learned fishing yet. So here, the Steven Sagnero is the fishing trainer. You wanna learn from him. And then, <laughs> lovely little Murloc doing his lovely little dance. And then the fishing supplies. You can get your fishing pole right here. Um, and then if you're new to fishing, I would recommend getting either some bright baubles or night crawlers to attract the fish a little bit better, but it's not needed, but I would recommend it. Or a shiny bauble, whichever one you want. All right, guys, so you wanna know where do I make my gold from and how do I make my gold? So if you have cooking, and if you don't, I apologize, you can, there's an alternative to making gold here. If you don't have cooking, you can make gold just by selling the fish as is that you fish up. However, if you do have cooking, go ahead and pick up the recipe for the sugar crested fish feast. You are gonna make that to sell after the dark moon fair is over. All right, so the sugar crusted fish feast, it takes five fish and what it will do is it's out a great feast that will feed a party, retires 10% of health and mana every second for 10 seconds and you will become well fed, increasing versatility for 20 minutes. This has a sell rate of 0 0.17 and a minimum buyout of 199 gold per feast. It's great for raids. It's great for parties, great for mythics. People seem to definitely utilize this as well as the fish. So as I said, if you don't have cooking, you can go ahead and fish up the fish alone and sell them because they also, when eaten, restore 5% of your health and mana per second for 20 seconds. And each fish sells for 19 gold at a 0.25 sell rate. So yeah, that's pretty much how I make my gold here in the Dark Moon Fair. That is it for my video today. I wish you all the best with this farm. I wish you some happy gold making, happy farming. Thank you so, so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye for now.